Dio. Uh, we're here with Dio and um, today we found out that Dio is an interesting person. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Listen, listen, uh, guys from home, Dio is an interesting person. He's really really interesting and today he's gonna bless us with some interesting things. Right? Right Dio? Yeah, daddy. But anyways, Dio, what you gonna say? <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm single. I, uh, I'm a man. And I also, uh, I like chocolate candy, so if you wanna hit me up with some of that, you know what I'm saying? I'll be at PDM, brother. Alright, alright, interesting. Um, so Dio, uh, do you like chicks with dicks? Oh, you mean food as hell? Yeah. Chicks with dicks, Dio. Do you like chicks with dicks? Chicks with dicks, yep. If it has a hole, there's a goal. Interesting, interesting. You hear that, home guys? If he got a hole, there we go. Um, <laughs> what do you think about Kanye? Kanye, I like his older shit. His new shit's alright. Next question mm -hmm. yeah, agree. is, would you smash Kim Kardashian? Yeah, but it would have to. Mm -hmm. I had to put a bag over her face because, like, that thing's too damn fake for me. But yes, I'd smash. Would you fuck a robot? Ah, uh, cause I would. I, I would fuck. A, yeah, it, like I said, if it looked good enough. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. He says that Kim Kardashian is ugly. You heard it here. Dio thinks that Kim Kardashian is fake and ugly. Yeah, I'm. I'm a Floridian. I'm, I was born in Florida. I mean, she get wiggy wiggy in Florida, bruh. Yeah, we crazy people. Uh-huh. Florida, you don't fuck with Florida people, bruh. So, yeah, yeah. tell me something that happened in your life in Florida. Uh, something criminal, something <laughs> gangster. <laughs> a guy fucked an alligator. We hear that here, guys. A guy fucked an alligator. Yeah, bruh. Only in Florida. Sir, 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 would you consider yourself a vegan? No. Why not? Because I don't not eat meat when it's cooked. What you said does not make any sense. Would you, would you like me to repeat the question? He's a yes, meatarian. Yeah, I'm a meatarian. There you go. A uh, meatarian. Never heard of it in my entire life. So, I mean, sir. Wait, can I say something? You ain't never heard of that in your whole goddamn life. Oh. Let's say a small documentary. Let's say let's say just a small documentary on on the living of EMS and how they're underappreciated and how they um, use use people for money. Um, um. <laughs> so hi everyone. We are here with uh, Toby and Dylan. Uh, these are, are the me. They are the amazing people of the EMS. Um, they're here to save lives and uh, fuck bitches. Right. Right. Just the first part yeah. is, is alright, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, save lives, of course, of course. Yeah, that's what you guys yeah. do. So, oh, shit. Uh, Toby, right, if that, if that yes. was your name, uh, what do you think that is good about your profession? Uh, just being able to help people, give people uh, a patch up and uh, send them back on their way. What about you, Dylan? Money. Oh, that's that's not good. That's not good. <laughs> guys. You heard it here. You heard it here. This is some juicy news. He says that he works for money. This guy's this guy. <laughs> this guy deserves to be fucking cancelled. All right, Twitter, YouTube. You heard it here. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> let's move on. Let's move on. Even though you work for money and you don't work for passion, <laughs> we move on. We'll oh move yeah, on. passion. <clears throat> So, um, Toby and uh, Dylan, um, would you guys uh, describe yourself mm -hmm. as good people? Funny. Um, I wouldn't describe myself as one, but as if a lot of people call me a good person, then I think mm -hmm. I think I am. But that's up to the other people, right? I'm not gonna call myself a good person. I'm not like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You seem like yeah. a person with goodwill, and uh, uh, you seem like a good person, yeah. I'll tell Thanks. you that. I appreciate mm -hmm. that, man. I'm not like your, your co-worker over there that uh. works for more. <laughs> <laughs> but... No, I'm a good person. I help citizens whenever they need. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah but if, if okay, if they don't have money, would you still help them? Huh? No. Huh? Hmm. Mm, you no. heard it here, folks. <laughs> uh, this guy is a horrible person, and he <laughs> does everything for money. You heard it here, folks. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, so next question. Next question. Oh, we Real have quick. patient people. Uh, help me, please. Yo, do you have money? <laughs> do you got money? Okay, I'll help. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> uh, folks, we are here with uh, the top dog of EMS, Tinky D Winky. Uh, Tinky D Winky, uh, she's a. Um, uh, experienced EMS worker. She's been working here for more than 10 years. Tiki Winky, you got something to say bef before we begin this interview? I'm a doctor. She's a doctor, everyone. She's a doctor. I'm not EMS worker. She's a doctor. She's not an EMS worker. Her words. All right. <clears throat> okay. Okay, bro. That's, that's what she does. That sounds like oh, what I wanna do. <laughs> Am I right, folks? I think, mm -hmm. Next question. So, what would you, what, why would you ever join the EMS people and become a doctor inside this establishment? Um, to help other people. Be honest, here, Tinky. Is there, <laughs> is there, some other reason for why you're doing this job? To help other people. Is there something money. called money? Listen, Toby, I um, knew it. Do you classify yourself as a good driver? Uh, if I think back to the last seven days, I think I've only been in an accident once. So I guess so, yeah. Hmm, hmm. You, you, we can easily compare to other drivers because everyone that actually crashes comes to hospital. And we see a lot of people that's, that have been into car crashes. Actually, can I use crashes. this platform? So, car and crashes are people... the main... A uh, reason for why people die, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm, interesting, interesting. You hear that here, folks? Don't drive. Just fucking use your moped. Shit. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is Weasel News, and I'm Big T. Hi, hi. So, um, what's your name, sir? Tell me, and um, how did you die? Oh, I got hit by a car. You heard it here, folks. You got hit by a car. It's... Right. <laughs> uh, listen up, sir. So I stabilized you. I banished your wounds up for now. <laughs> That's not me, though. That's not me. Anyways, right? Tommy. Well, uh, yeah. Boy. Anyways, Tommy. Um. Uh. What do you think about the situation over here? Do you think that the EMS worker did a great job on, of, on helping you? Well, yeah, you got, you got here pretty fast, so... Hmm. You got here pretty fast, alright. I mean, that's what she said, am I right, folks? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, if it's like that, it's like that. If I save a life, then it's good. I'll be a... Uh... Three pump Danny, if you know what I mean. My ribs are in stitches, literally. <laughs> are you making jokes while a guy is dying? Oh my god, Yo, this is absolutely to... disgraceful. Nah, nah, nah. I have to, uh. Someone life. You see this? So, he's putting his hand on his cock, and now, now he's, he's kinda. he's pulsating, and he's fucking. Uh, Doing some weird procedures over here. You see that? You see that? You see that, folks? No, it was a just a random jackass. He hit me with his car on the way to the gas station. All right, so I'm gonna clean up those wounds for you and stitch them up and give you an. He cleaned the wounds and he put on an ice pack. Thank you so, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thanks, Tommy, for being on Weasel News. Okay. No problem. Listen, can I ask your question, sir? Sir, sir, please, please don't go. Can I ask your question? What do you think about this uh, this quality of the EMS, sir? What do you think about them? I give it like a, a seven out of ten. Like when I'm over here, they always come give me. But like if I'm anywhere like, else, yeah, I'm dead. Nah, man. I I came for you like three times already in the exotic car. So you say that yeah, the EMS yeah. is nah, fucking I mean, dog look, shit. Look, look, look. If I'm like in no, the middle, we need money and then we respond. Yeah. I came. Who came looking for me? 
Huh? Did you say someone came looking for me? No, nah, no, nah, we're just uh, making that. It's just a quick interview, you know? So, we're talking about the review of EMS and now EMS is fucking dog shit and uh, blah, blah, blah. Wait, wait, wait. I'm not going to say it like that bad because they do do their job, bro. Okay, okay. Like, so, if you're anywhere, like, in the middle to, so, like, the end of the map, they're not going to come meet you. Yeah, because it's like, you'll die. No, I mean, 300 right. in, in some seconds is a lot of time. Yeah, that's yes, we saying that, are, are you saying that EMS needs to be improved? Yeah, get them like Hellcats or some shit. We don't it have should be, money. It should be the, you should blame the mayor for this. <laughs> exactly, the mayor is all wrong. Uh, yeah, I guess. Would you, yeah, what do right. you think, would you, who's gonna win the next election? Uh, it's me. But yeah. Yeah. If you were mayor, if you, if you over here were mayor, what would you change in the city? Um, I'll make guns free. I'll make, uh, killing people legal. I'll make oh, it like a purge, buy. basically. Yeah. Oh, Killing people. Was... Hey there, here, folks. This guy is a warmonger and he wants everyone to be dead. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Fuck beautiful, everybody. Beautiful. I done got robbed like 10 times. Beautiful, beautiful. You hear yep, that yep. here, folks? People in Santos are fucking crazy and mental and fucking <laughs> like guns. You hear that here, folks? Smash or pass. All right. Folks, uh, we are back on here with Smash or pass. Our favorite section of the news. All right. Um, um, are you ready? Are you ready for the, for the quick smash or pass? All right. Yes. As as I said before, Kim Kardashian smash or pass? Smash. Ooh, yep. you had it here, folks. You yep. had it here. <laughs> <laughs> you are back. I mean, yep. Yeah, All right. He said. Smash. So hello, hello. Help me, doctor. Hey, save this guy. All right. You got so the card next, uh, Cardi B. Smash uh, or pass? Ugly as fuck. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I mean, we don't, ugly. we do, we do not use the term ugly in this building, what? sir. What? Cardi B? Yeah. That's fucked up. Crazy, 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 crazy. So next question. <clears throat> Smash or pass, Queen Elizabeth II. Oh, smash her into the grave. <laughs> you, you hear that here, folks? He likes to fuck dead people. <laughs> you hear that here, folks? EMS people like fucking dead people. Necrophilia is at the whole time high in this city of Los Santos. So we are here with uh, Ash Smith. Uh, you already went through the introduction, and now let's get into the juicy super things about Burger Shop. <laughs> like the juicy burgers, am I right? <laughs> You're not wrong there. Super juicy. It's good, go. mate. Um, you are back here with Ash Smith and um, her lovely, lovely uh, employee. Uh, what's your name, Miss? Rain. Rain. Um, rain, rain, rain. Uh, if I can ask you, um, um, do you like Ash Smith as your boss? Yeah, he's really nice and easygoing. Uh, he he, try, he tries to keep up the uh, burger shop, shop vibes and keep everything positive and just bring do what's best for the customers and help everybody out. You heard it here, folks. Burger Shop is an amazing fucking place. So. Come in! I would just like to thank everyone in Los Santos who comes and supports Burger Shot. I'd also like to thank everyone in Los Santos who comes and is a part of the Burger Shot fam, supports us and helps spread the good vibes. I'd also like to st thank all of my staff members. All of my staff members are just incredible human beings, absolute superstars, and just blessed. I'm just blessed to be here, brother. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> and remember, everyone, <laughs> burger shot, put your heaven in your bun, or whatever the phrase is. 